So what's up guys? Uh, welcome back to my channel. This is uh, Pinitiki again. So in this video guys, uh, let's discuss about the Simatic timer, timer on delay. Uh, in our uh, basic STL programming. So this is the example of our uh, what called what called this one timer on delay of Simatic timer. This is the other uh, example. So let's uh, code here in our uh, STL uh, language. So here in our uh, main program. Okay, let's uh, start. Put her uh, name uh, timer um, delay. So here first our uh, first input, this type A, and our uh, first input I zero dot zero. Our tag start. Next uh, for our uh, uh, timer. Timer time, uh, I put uh, L for our load, then uh, is, is 5, D, hash, and for example, 15 seconds, and for our uh, timer, is D, uh, set on delay, and put T1, And then for our uh, uh, receipt is just type A normally open for our uh, is zero that one and for our receipt timer is type R uh, T1 and for our uh, output just put type a for our an and we just type t1 and for our output let's type q0.0 .0. and then for our uh, uh, current value just put Typers L for load, type T1, and then for our uh, uh, transfer, M0.0, so just like this. So I put her on uh, tag name. Start. Timer preset value next start start on delay and here for our preset. Timer and here for our output and here for our uh, trans transfer current value timer. So that's all, guys. So let's uh, compile first. We'll check uh, if there's no error. Okay, there's no error. Download. Load. And monitor. And let's open our FPL uh, system. And run. Okay, let's simulate. Okay, start. 
So guys, our timer is, uh, is enabled. After 15 seconds, uh, automatic stop. And our output will be on. Okay guys, uh, reset. Okay, reset. And start again. Then if you want to reset, reset. Back to zero the timer value. And again, again counting timer. So that's all, guys. I hope uh, this video uh, yeah, is very uh, helpful. Uh, from uh, our subscribe, sub, sub, subscriber. You guys, thank you very much. Bye-bye.